Hey guys, it is Corbin here with Outdoor Fanatics, and today we are going to be reacting to my trail camera pictures. We went down the other day and grabbed some. I have them on my phone right now. Um, we don't have, uh, we have a couple decent bucks, uh, some spikes, a lot of does, but um, we're going to get into it and show you. Um, and yeah, let's get into the video. Okay, so first we have a doe over here. Um, she's coming in late at night. Then we have a, a bucket four-pointer. I actually saw this guy, um, about, I think, I think it was youth day all for Maryland. And he was 50 yards away, um, in the food plot. And his antler is actually pretty cool because his antler comes across his face. But I think it's kind of, um, getting in his way of, of putting his face to the ground and actually eating. So I'm not sure how much that is affecting him. There he is leaving. There's my dad going to stand. And then we have a lot of turkeys. I'm very excited because we might be going turkey hunting in the springtime, which I believe, I'm not sure, is April and, like, parts of May. But we got, like, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven turkeys. So that's, that's a pretty good amount. There they are again chomping at it at 3 o'clock. There's my dad leaving. Um, Then we have, there's my dad again. And then, then we have a little spike here, as we can as we can see. Yeah, I mean, I think I'm, um, I'm not sure, but we did see a spike around that uh, size in in the stand. I'm not sure if that's the same one. Yeah, but he came around ten thirty, and then we got this guy seven thirty. Like I said, same guy. His antler comes across his face. I think he's just a little four pointer. Um, then we have him daylighting right there. That's pretty cool seeing him out there at f four. That's pretty cool. You can see a good. Oh, that actually might be not him. That might be a. Because uh... that looks like a stick in front of it. I'm not sure, guys. That if that's him, I'm not sure if that's a... him or not. Uh, it might be him. Yeah, I think it is him. All right. Yeah, and then we have a. You know, as we can see, his hammer coming across. So this guy clear, clearly sees there's corn around here, and he is just chomping it up. Then we got some raccoons over there, just bedding, basically. Um. Then we got, that's either, I think that, yeah, I think that is him. Yep, and so we got him again, him again. I mean, he is just eating up that corn, so you got a raccoon right there. Don't know if we have anything in that picture. Might be a squirrel or something. Oh, oh nice little six-pointer. That is actually really good. I definitely going to be looking out for him in the, you know, probably two or three years because as you guys can see, I mean, that, well, I'm screen recording, but that is good genetics. He already has brow tines, and he's probably, what, maybe a two-year-old deer? Not Maybe not even that, sorry. Probably even a, a one-year-old deer. I mean, that's really good genetics. That is, I'll definitely be looking out for that guy. There he is again. There he is just feeding up on that corn. But like I said, that is, yeah, that's good genes. That's definitely very good genes. So we got him again, him again, doe, raccoon. Do, do, we should probably name him. What, what should we name him? I'm not even sure. But he is definitely always at that corn pile. That's, no, that's not, that's a little, like, spike there, I think. Yeah, a little spike. Him leaving, not sure if there's a, oh, there's a, there's a deer. Then we got, is that a doe? That's a spike, all right. Um, yep, just feeding up on that corn pile. You know, let him, then we have a little raccoon right there. Then we have, I'm not sure which one that is. Oh, that's a, what is that, like a three-pointer? Yeah. Three pointer, just a little box. I mean, nothing huge. Most of the big box, as you can, I mean, it's it's the end. It was the end of gun season, so most of them are dead, you know. But uh, because we have a, a lot of hunters that hunt ours, so oh, it's um got that one. That was that's that three pointer, I think, and then that's all half rack. Oh, look at him sparring. That is cool, guys. That is cool to see that those deer are sparring. That's pretty cool. It's them leaving, eating them corn. 
And then I think from here on out, like some, I, I think my dad put out corn again there. So dough, two doughs, another dough, dough, raccoon, raccoon. Look at that. Raccoon standing up on his hind legs. That's pretty cool to see. Um, raccoon, I think there's a dough back there. Two doughs. Two doughs again, you know, just some regular stuff, guys. Not nothing crazy. There's that little think spike. It's like a spike or something like that. Oh, uh, he's like a what is he like a three pointer, something like that. There that, again, there he is, that one with the little thing coming across his face. He's always eating that corn. He's gonna be a big deer. Keeps eating like that, we'll have us a big deer. And then we got a, let's see, a fox. Man, he's booking it. Three does, three does, just chomping at it. I guess there's a mom and her two fawns. Um, you know, just does chomping all night. Come back the next day, keep chomping on that corn. Mm, they're putting a, uh, a hurting on that corn there. Yeah, guys, but if you like these videos, please comment down below, and I will uh, set out the trail camera and put it back. Um, but, you know, I'm not sure how many times we're going to be able to get down there. There looks like a, yeah, a little spike with a, with a split rack right there. Oh, where was I? I'm on right here, I think. Yep. And, yeah, so, I'm going to throw them to show you guys. Doe coming down there. Nice doe. We got a, you know, that same, same buck with the antler coming across his face. Need a name for him. Um, you, you know, he's been on the thing a lot. Uh, we have a little raccoon. Never trapped. I might get my trapper's license. I'm not sure yet. We have plenty of, um, ro you know, we have plenty of animals down there we can do. We have possums, uh, po some, some coyotes, a lot of red foxes, um, and then raccoons, obviously. Um, and then a little, little spike there. I think, yeah, he entered right there in that picture. Just a little spike, you know. Let him live to grow, but uh, then that same buck, he is eating up our corn. Mm, that's gonna be the biggest deer on the farm. And then uh, I don't think anything. Oh wait, we have that it looks like a doe, and then that looks like a doe as well. And then nothing right here. Oh, there is a deer right there, a doe, turkey. Very excited to go turkey hunting. I mean, I think it'd be a great experience. I've heard great things about it. Um, and we have plenty of turkeys down there, so why not, you know? Spring springtime, turkeys be ready. But, uh, yep, oh, finally the decent big boys come out. I mean, next year, we don't know. I'm not sure if that's an eight-point or six-point, but uh, I can't really see if he has brow tines or not. Um, but next year, I'm not sure. If he if – he, Plans out to be a big buck, you know, I'll decide if he's right there or not. But, um, you know, tall rack, tight and tall rack, cool looking. Next year, if he's big, I'll be looking for him. And we got that little three-pointer right there. Him walking out. Plenty of turkeys, like I said. Turkey Jason. Plenty of turkeys. Plenty, plenty, plenty. And then we have a... A little spike, then just regular dough, or that spike, that's dough. Regular, you know, just, just a, yeah, it's a dough, dough. Another big boy, he looks different, because I think he's, he looks wider, and I can see his brow tines. Actually, big brow tines. Next year, that might be a very, very nice deer. Hopefully, uh, it looks like two or three year old deer. Doe leaving. I think this is we're coming down to the wire here. Uh, turkeys and yeah, that's it. So guys, if you did enjoy um, today's video, please make sure to like and subscribe. It will really help out with the channel. I'm trying to post more in here. I know I took a little, little bit of a break, but now I really want to try to get more content out for you guys. And yeah, uh, any suggestions down below? Let's try to find a name for that buck because he's stealing up the show here, guys. Um, yeah. But uh, I will see you all next time, and thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time. Bye.